Hi guys, this is Sarah from the Savvy Professor, and today we'll talk about the credit scores you need if you want to lease a car. This video will let you know the credit score guidelines for leasing cars and the limits different credit scores place on your negotiation terms. First, why should you consider a car lease? If you want a new vehicle, you only have two financing choices, taking a loan or leasing it. Between the two, leasing is an affordable and convenient option when you want to get a brand new vehicle because it doesn't require high down payments, and its monthly payments are lower than those of a loan. Your credit score will still be accounted for when requesting a lease, so it's important to know your score before you go to a dealership to buy your dream car. What credit scores do you need for a car lease? In most instances, you'll require a credit score of between 620 and 640 if you want to qualify for a lease. But also be mindful that a lower score reduces your negotiation options. These options are Super Prime. This is available to people with a credit score of 780 or higher. Qualifying in this category allows you to get the best interest rate offers as you're considered a minimal risk. Prime. This is available if you have a score between 660 and 780. The chances of your lease request being approved are very high, but they're not as high as that of a super prime candidate. Non-prime. This is for people with credit scores of between 600 and 660. You might be approved if you're applying for a lease, but this is on condition that you might need to make a down payment and pay higher interest rates than a prime or super prime lacy. Subprime. This is for people with scores lower than 600. In most cases, you'll fail to qualify for a lease, and even if you're approved, you'll be subject to stricter financial requirements. So, if you've enjoyed the video, leave a like, share it, and leave a comment down below. Thanks for watching. Till next time.